Hello and welcome to my channel. My name is Sandy. This is the Sister Cousin Lifestyle channel. Today I'm doing some light cleaning and doing the initial setup for the master bath at my um, son and daughter-in-law's home. I've shared previously that I am helping them with their um, setup and decorating in their home. And so today is the day that I do the master bathroom. So if you like to see how it turns out, then just keep watching. This modern bathroom is a decorator's dream. It's a blank slate. However, it has a beautiful natural uh, foundation to get started. Now, again, I said this is like the initial setup. I'm going to be adding decor to the space, but it is by far not the final look. Um, they are ordering things. This is a brand new home. They're just now getting in. So they've ordered things. Things are on back order and all of that due to um, the pandemic. So, you know, some things will be slow to come in. But I think that what I've done for the initial start is beautiful to get them going. And they love the final results. And that's what's most important. <laughs> Now, I didn't have to do any deep cleaning because, again, it is brand new, but I did do some, just some basic cleaning just to get myself started here. So the first thing I'm going to do is add this shower caddy. Um, they're going with the black and white theme for their um, master bathroom. So I'm going to put this caddy, it's a black caddy inside there for their toiletry items this is real life, guys. I know you see bathrooms where you don't see any toiletry items or anything like that. This is real life and people need to use shower things. So they're going here, but they do have a really nice black shower caddy to go with their decor. So we're just going to set that in there accessible to them as they take their shower. I just love the space in this bathroom. It is like a dream bathroom. I really love it. My daughter-in-law said, you know, you're welcome to come over and take a bath anytime. I'm like, I would never do that. But it's nice to know that I can. <laughs> All right, here is the tub. It is a garden-sized tub. And I'm going to be putting some decor around the corners there. I'm just going to start off with some apothecary jars with some Epsom salts and um, bath items um, in there. I just think that that is just such a good look to have those items displayed in a beautiful way. So I'm just putting these apothecary jars in here, which I think is a great look. Now, some of the decor items that will be done in this space is they will be adding window treatments to the window. Um, there will also be some floating shelves. Uh, they will be black in color. They're going to be put right above that uh, towel rack right there. They're going to be removing that. That towel rack where it's placed is kind of um, in a weird place and is not really functional for the day to day. So they're going to just go ahead and replace that with some decorative uh, shelving. Now I'm putting these black uh, hand towels in here. I usually like to have these in my bathroom because... They're great for removing makeup. You can use them for uh, hand towels. You know, when you wash your hands, you can use them for just washing your face, whatever. So um, I'm just placing them here for them and they can use them how they see fit or not. <laughs> but I thought it was a good look for this um, setup here. And then I just placed a towel there on that rack just for this video. Um, like I said, that towel rack is going to be coming down. And then what is a garden tub without some type of pillow or comfort in the space? So that's what we're doing there. And then I have this um, royal bamboo tub caddy that I'm opening up here to go in the space. And what I like about this is it is black. You know, normally you see the bamboo in the, the natural wood color, but this one is black, which I thought was a really good look since the space is black, white, and gray. So we're just going to go ahead and get that opened up and get it over there. And, you know, as with any caddy, uh oh, I'm breaking it, guys. I'm so sorry. <laughs> All is well. It is made of bamboo. It is very, very durable. So no pieces were harmed in this demonstration. <laughs> So let's go ahead and get this thing um, set up. I will be cleaning it before putting it in the space, of course. But um, yeah, so it is a adjustable uh, caddy. 
It has a space there for your wood. Look at that little sign. Isn't that cute? Do not disturb. King is, is uh, whatever it said. <laughs> And then the other side is for the queen. So it was really cute. Just like a little do not disturb sign there. And then here's the caddy. It's really nice. Like I said, they can put a book there, a glass of wine, glass of water, juice, what have you, uh, a candle. It's really nice um, to have this just so that if you're taking a nice little relaxing soak, you can um, have that to have your things handy, you know, have your music or what have you there. So now I'm just taking a sneak peek at the vanity lights that are going to be going up. They will not be going up in this video because that's not the type of work that I do. <laughs> but I am opening them up just to take a look at it. Now, I am retired, and so that is one of the reasons why I'm helping them. I love home decor. I love cleaning, things like that. Both of them have very, very demanding jobs, and they have two small children. And so I come in to help out where they ask me to help. So those are the vanity lights. They are black, and it's kind of like an industrial look. Um, and then the big globes there, those are going to look so good with some Edison light bulbs in it. That's going to be a real vibe. I like it a lot. All right, so I'm just going to move this on out of the way and um, so that I can go ahead and get started with the vanity. So I'm going to start off with, you know, some really light cleaning here, nothing major, but just kind of shine things up a little bit before we get started placing decor. So I'm going to be helping them with each space of the home. So if you're enjoying this video, be sure that you hit that subscribe button before you leave today and the notification bell so that you're notified each time I upload a video. I um, enjoy doing this type of content. I uh, offer a lot of home decor and cleaning content on my channel at my home but this is the first for them since they have moved to the area so i'm super excited to have another space to help out with with them getting set up so i'm just uh finishing up the light cleaning here and we just have a little bit of decor that we're going to be putting into this space um i picked up this uh soap dispenser from uh at home or ross one of them i think i'll show the tag in a minute actually i do think it was ross but anyway it was the marble look with the black and i knew that this would fit perfectly for this space um so i picked it up and it is by the brand isaac mizrahi um, but it's a really nice little dispenser here. So I just got to get this glue off. I just hate that glue they put on these things. It is so hard to get off. And I know you can get it off with alcohol and um, Dawn dish soap and different things like that. But I don't have any handy and I don't feel like going to try to look for any. I'm not at my house. So <laughs> just have to peel it off and mess up my nails. But here we go. Um, we're going to place that there. And then these little caddies here for their um, toilet, not toiletries, but like their um, Q-tips and different things like that. Um, it will be a unisex bathroom. So, you know, the colors, I really like how, you know, they could go, um, you know, either way, very masculine, but also very elegant at the same time, which is a great combination when you're creating a unisex space. And then I got this reed diffuser here that we're just going to put down in here just for a little bit of um, scent for the bathroom. You can't have a bathroom if it doesn't smell good. I just love smell good. So we're just going to put these out here. And of course, with these, you need to, you know, turn the reeds around every now and then to keep your scent going. All right, guys. <laughs>
Thanks so much for sticking around to the end of this video. I appreciate you so much. I hope each of you have a wonderful day and I hope to see you over here on my next video. Bye.